Hey, what's going on YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to change the background of your dashboard, which is the little space here with all of your widgets here on Mac OS X Lion. Uh, now, it's the, ba it's the background here behind all the widgets. Uh, it looks like a bunch of circles, like a Lego or something, but it we're going to change that just a bit, make it something cool, whatever you like. So I would advise you do not to try this on any other Mac OS X. You have to have Mac OS X Lion. Do not try this on Snow Leopard or Mountain Lion or anything else because I'm not sure if they work. So do, the, do that on your own risk. But I know that they work perfectly fine on Lion and are completely safe. So yeah, you have to have Mac OS X version 10.7. Whether that's 10.7.4, 5, 1, 2, or 3, doesn't matter. It has to be 10.7. Anyhow, so let's get on with the process. The first thing that the wallpaper that you want to apply behind your widgets over here on dashboard, it has to be in a PNG format. So now I'm going to be trying to apply. I'm going to try to apply this wallpaper, and if you look at it, it is a JPEG. Now we need a PNG image, so we need to convert this to a PNG. So what we're going to do is we're going to double click and open it with the, the preview app. And once that opens up, we will wait for it to open. And once that opens up, we will click File, and then we will click Export and then we'll make the quality the best and then we instead of the format being JPEG we click PNG so it has to be a PNG file and then you just do that to your desktop and save and yes that will be exported so we just delete the old one we don't need that anymore and this is the new one and now this is a PNG file as you can see there we go PNG anyhow so yeah, so now we have our PNG file, and now what you're going to do is you're going to open Finder, and you're going to go on your hard drive, Macintosh HD. If you don't have this button, if you can't find Macintosh HD, uh, just click Go, and then click Go to Folder, and then type this in, System slash Library slash Core Services, and then click Go. And then you'll be in the Core Services folder. Or you could just do it the manual way by going to Macintosh HD and then System, and then Library, Core Services, and bam, you're there. Once you're in Core Services, you look for this file. It's, a, it's an app. It's called Doc. So don't open this. Right-click it, Control-click, and then click Show Package Contents. Once you see, once you once you click on that, click on Contents, and then Resources. Once you're in resources, you should find this file, Pirelli.png, this one right here. And now we have to replace this because this is the default image. So what we're going to do is first you need to back this up because in case you want to, this is the one, this is the one that you have currently. So you want to back this up in case you're ever going to need to put it back to the original. So you're gonna, just going to name this for now. Let's just name this. Pirelli backup and now we're gonna name the wallpaper that we want to Pirelli so it has to be named Pirelli P-I-R-E-L-L-I -L -L and then you press copy and just paste it into this folder right here paste it into resources click paste now it'll say that it already exists, so you're going to replace it with the old one. Make sure you have your original file backed up in case you want to restore to the original wallpaper. So click replace. And now type in your password. And it'll be done. That's, that's it for that. And now you're going to notice that you still have the boring old wallpaper so to get it you have to do one last step you have to open the app called terminal which you can either do by going into your utilities and navigating to terminal and clicking on that or you could just go on spotlight and type in terminal and then you click on it and you open terminal and once you're in terminal you'll type in this command which I, which you can see on the screen kill all doc so the kill all will be a lowercase and then there's a space and then doc and the D will be uppercase. So you just click enter and then your doc will go away and come back and you just close exit that and then you go to your dashboard and bam there's your new wallpaper.
so your dashboard no longer looks old or boring it looks great your new wallpaper is there you have a changed wallpaper and you did it in very less time so if you would like to go back to your old wallpaper you just this is the old one you just remove the backup and of course whatever whatever wallpaper you're switching has to be named Pirelli and then you copy it go to the folder core services and then open show package contents go into resources and then paste it and then replace it again and then you have your old wallpaper and then of course don't forget to do the terminal command because it won't be there it'll still be the old one so click kill all space capital D OCK and then bam you'll have your old wallpaper back again so that's very, really easy guys make, again make sure that you only try this on Mac OS 10.7 Lion and make sure that you don't that you have your file backed up anyway guys if this video helped you please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel for ma more Mac videos and more gaming videos thanks for watching